So you're in Walmart and you're looking for something like this and you're wondering, should you pick this up? I would 100% agree and say yes. Uh, TLDR, spoiler alert, this thing's awesome for what it does or wherever, how it looks on your wall and everything. We'll get to B-roll in, in the future. But I know some people be in Walmart and be like, should I pick this up? And they try to look for a video or wherever and they're wondering if they should get it. Then yes, if you have time or you're watching this at a later date or something like that and you're still wondering about this, um, we'll get into some in-depth things or wherever, some pros, some cons, and uh, then wrap up the video. First of all, I want to say the unboxing is, is fairly simple, super quick. Um, everything you need or wherever is right there in the booklet. You can see uh, pretty much what you get right out the box. Um, there's nothing special there, unboxing or anything. I will say it took a little while to set this thing up um, just because you have to uncoil it from the little spool wherever it comes with and then sticking it on the wall and putting an adhesive and all that stuff and sticking it into that metal, metal uh, connector or wherever to supply power to all of, all of it in general, um, it does take a while. The second con is going to be the fact of the LED strip that you see right here that goes all the way bot to the bottom or wherever. Um, it has a small little section or wherever of a USB cord or wherever that you connect it to after that long strand. That long strand is meant to be laying, uh, go all the way down to the bottom of a wall or something like that. And then you're supposed to line this up or wherever into a USB and then plug into a USB port or wherever, or like a USB to wall charger thing. Um, the problem with that is that this section right here is not long. It is completely short. Um, so you're going to need some kind of USB extender like this or wherever. Um, you can find them fairly cheap at probably even Walmart, uh, Dollar Tree, order off of Amazon or something like that, get you a 12 foot one. Um, you should always have something like this anyways. I have a couple of them lying around the house wherever, so it's not a problem for me. But just know if you are going to get this thing, unless you're putting it right above an outlet, um, then you're probably not going to have any space uh, or I would say cable length or wherever to plug this right into a wall or anything like that. Even if it's slightly away from the plug, it's just super short. Um, other than that, that's my only complaints. You have enough, I would say, variations on the remote. All right, so Future Squid here. I am currently shooting the B-roll for this uh, product, and I want to go ahead and stress that you should get this. Again, if you're in Walmart or you're around Walmart or something like that, and you're looking for something that can fit on your wall, wherever you can cut this down to shape and stuff too, um, just make sure you're cutting at the appropriate lines or wherever or indicators um, so you can you know, shorten it or whatever. It still has those caveats of, needing a longer USB cable and everything on the tail end to plug this in. Um, but again, if you have the space on your wall and you're looking for something to just upgrade or decorate your room or wherever, this is fairly inexpensive, super budget friendly. And the customization op the options that you get with this remote, all you have to do is select one of these on the side, these different color options right here that you see. This means color spectrum, the CS. And all you have to do is click that and then click any of these animations over here on the far side. And what that allows you to do is to have multiple different color options and multiple uh, matches of colors together and just having so many different patterns. I don't know how this thing is this price. I really don't. It's like 15, 20 bucks or something. I don't understand how this is this price. Like, yeah, you don't get super deep uh, customization options like you do with the Govee curtain light. And you can't like, you know, match your own colors. Like if you want blue and purple together, like my color scheme that I usually use. But even at, for this price point, this thing, I could easily see this thing costing $40, $40, like maybe 50 or wherever or below. But for this option or wherever, this company, what is this company, bro? <laughs> Go pick this up now. You have the space for it and you're looking for cheap RGB lighting for your setup. Go buy it. I don't know why you're still watching the video. Just just go again from for the price point for something like this or wherever going on the wall. Um, mind you, I have something from Govee, which is called a uh, Govee curtain lights that dropped in 2023. Um, they're $130. Now you get a lot of access with different types of things or wherever inside the Gobi app and you can DIY your own pixel art and all that stuff, do a whole bunch of stuff. And it's absolutely worth the $130. But if you're looking for something cheap to just go on the wall, LED lights, I mean, you can't really beat this price. 100% recommend these. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the little B-roll. My glider broke today, so I don't have any smooth footage of it. It's just gonna be you looking at the thing instead of panning or, or moving or anything. It's always something, isn't it? 
With that being said, y'all take care. Have a squid-tastic day. God bless you and yours. And deuces, everybody. Don't forget to like the video, sub if you're new to the channel. Check out the live streams. All those links to the socials are down in the description. Uh, if you want to order this on Walmart or if I can find it on any other website or wherever, I'll link it down below as well. And uh, yeah, God bless you and yours. Have a squid-tastic day. And deuces, everybody. Much love.